Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is DB June 101, and also welcome back to our typing club. This morning, we are going to continue our typing club, especially the vocabulary and spelling. We are now in week number three for our typing club. But before anything else, we have our five second challenge. In five, four, three, two, one. To subscribe my channel, if you are not yet a subscriber to my channel, please don't forget to click subscribe and the notification bell so that you will be notified for our new video in our channel okay so please don't forget to subscribe my channel db june 101 and if you like this video don't forget to like and share it with your friends okay so going back to our typing club especially our uh, vocabulary and spelling so we are now in lesson number we are now in lesson number three a week number three that is lesson number 24 to lesson number uh, 34 okay so we will start here week number three that's R -E or re and lesson number 24 is a video it's all about prefixes and suffixes so we'll watch the video return rewrite rebuild do you notice a common pattern in these words that's right each of these words starts with re it's time to learn a new prefix re means again or back so rewrite means to write again. Return means to go back to a place or give something back. Tip number one. Remember, not all words that start with RE are prefix words. For example, rescue starts with RE, but when we take away the RE, we are left with skew, which isn't a word on its own. Tip two. Some words have a meaning unrelated to the parts that make up the word. For example, Reside doesn't mean to side again. We can't always break down a word to its parts to understand its meaning, but we can use context clues to help. Let's go learn some new words. Okay, so after you watch the rewrite, video, we will go now to lesson number five, the definition. So in the definition, this is uh, more crucial. So if you have your pencil with you or your pen, you need, you need to write this definition or the words that we are going to learn this uh, day. So let's start with the word rewrite. Okay, so you have your meaning and sample sentence, for example, like this. Please rewrite your essay to be clearer. Then go to the next Review. word. Review. Next. Return. Retell. Rebuild. So one of the tip in answering this uh, week number three, you need to write the word because this definition words, sight words, will be used from uh, next activity, lesson number 26 to lesson number 34. So you must, uh, you must remember and you must list down these words. Horse. Birds. Problem. Complete. Room. Re. Okay, so you're done. Birds we are now flew in overhead lesson number as 26. Molly rode her horse along the trail. Just a little bit further, then she would return to the farm. On the way, she was thinking about the play. Birds. So remember, we are now in the story. So using our keyboard, our keyboard, so we will now type the words that's shown in our screen. That's horse. Next. Return. 
Molly and her friends were getting ready to put on a play. But the problem was that last summer, a big storm had blown through and damaged the stage. They needed tools and supplies to rebuild the stage if they were going to be ready in time. Problem. Rebuild. This year, they were going to retell Little Red Riding Hood, where the wolf was the good guy. They decided to rewrite the play to tell the wolf's side of the story. Retell. That's the next word. Rewrite. Once the repairs on the stage were complete, they could review their lines and have their first dress rehearsal. Complete. Review. They were nearly done painting the backdrops. One that looked like a forest and one that looked like Grandma's room. This year's play was going to be their best yet. Room. Okay, so we're done with the story, lesson number 26. Next, let's click the arrow. If you want to check your lesson, all you need to do is to click these three lines here. Okay, so you are now in, you're done with lesson number 26. Move on to lesson number 27, uh, which is the spelling practice. After this one is the dictation, did the drop quiz, the jumble, fill in the blanks, and then the multiple choice and the proof reading and then the crossword. So we will go next to the lesson number 27. Return. Okay. Return. Problem. Problem. Review. Review. Complete. Complete. Birds. Birds. If you notice, the words that we are typing is the same word in the definition. Retell. Retell. Rebuild. Rebuild. Horse. Horse. Room. Room. Rewrite. Rewrite. Okay, so we're done with the spelling practice. And then let's move on to the next lesson, number Problem. 20. Uh, dictation. So the speaker will dictate the the words and then we will we are going to type. For example, problem. Can you hear it? Check. Next. Birds. Check. Next. Return. Can you hear it? It's return. Check. Next. Retell. Rebuild. So if you can see, the words that we are typing now is from the definition word. Check. Room. Review. Horse. Rewrite. Complete. Okay, so we have five stars, 1,000 points score. Next, we are done in a dictation. Next, go to the drop quiz. So in the drop quiz, uh, the definition is given. 
and you will choose the word. For example, animals that lays eggs and have wings and bodies covered with feathers. This is bird. One. Next. Having only sorry parts that lacking anything. What is that? Having all necessary parts. Not lacking anything. What is that? Room, review, horse, complete. Okay. Next, to tell, that is retell. To go back or go back again, what is that? Return. Next one. So if you can see, this one is the definition from lesson number 20, 25, right? So if you list down this definition, it's easy for you to answer. Divided part of the inside of the building, what is that? Divided part is room. To study or look at something again. To review. Next, a large Hoft animals that feed especially of grasses on grasses. That's a horse. Next is to build again something again after it has been damaged. So it's rebuilt. Two more. Something to be worked out or sold. That is a problem. And the last one is of course the rewrite. To write. Okay, 1,000, we have got a perfect score. And then next, this time goes to lesson number 9, that is a jumble. So what is this one? What is this word? Review. Next word. What is this word? This one is, what is this? Birds. So if you list down your word before given by the definition, it's easy for you to answer. This one is horse. Next, this one is, what is this? Rebuild. Another, another word, this is, what word is that? Return. So I list down my, my words from the definition before I start. That is room. This one is rewrite. This one is retell. So if you write your words in a paper, you the list of words and the definition, it's easy for you to answer. This one is problem. One more. This one is complete. And you're done. So we are done with the jumble words. So we got perfect score and five stars. Next, let's go to the fill in the blanks. So you have your sentences and the blank and you will fill in with the words here. We have 10 words. Words complete, horse problem rebuild, retell, return, Review, rewrites, and room. Okay, so we can't wait to blank to his aunt's house. Return. The mat blank was hard to. Okay, so problem. Many blank flew over, over head. Okay. Please blank your. AC to be clearer. Re write. She rode her a horse. Which blank would you like the TV? Okay, it's a. Please blank the story so that I can hear it again. So you need to retell. I am going to blank. An old house. Old house, so you need to rebuild. Two more. Let's blank the lesson again. Review. And she had 
blank set of books for complete. Sorry. I jump up to the next one. So we're done with lesson number 31. Next. Let's go to the next lesson. We got full score. Next lesson is multiple choice. Rewrite. What is rewrite? To write something. Click. Okay. Continue. She rode her horse. Next. To tell the story again. That is retell. So be careful in clicking the multiple choice because sometimes uh, this one like this. They misspelled the word. Having any sorry parts, it's complete. You can see the spelling is wrong. So you, you better check the spelling if that is correct. Next, rebuild. Where's rebuilding here? Is this a rebuilding? Where? This one? Check. Okay, good job. Next, where's the room here? Room. This one. Okay, good. Next, this is a bird. Okay. These are the birds. Next. This is a, you can see the spelling problem. So better check the spelling first before you are going to click and check. Next. Review. Review. Where's review here? Is this correct? Which comes first? I or E? So it's I. Check. Almost done. Return. Where's return here? Return. Where's return? Okay, good job. Next. Re means again. Very going to with. Again. So we have our result. Check. Okay. It's good. Next, next one. We are now in the proofreading. Proofreading is finding the wrong uh, sentence, correct spelling, or wrong spelling in the passage. So this year. They, you can see, comma, so this one should be small letter T. Apply. Next, we're going to retell. Correct spelling, wrong. It's wrong. So it should be 2L. Apply. Next, little red riding hood where the wolf was the good guy. They decided to rewrite. Is this correct? It's wrong. So rewrite is apply the play to tell the wolf side of the story. Once once the repairs on the stage were complete, you can see complete. It's a wrong spelling. Check spelling. Let letter E and then apply. They could review. Review. You remember the, the spelling of review? Okay. What's the spelling of review? Re, first one is I, okay, I, E, view. So I think it's five and check, retail, and all are correct. Okay, so we are in the last part now, 1000, got the perfect score. We are in the last one now, the crossword puzzle. So we will start with number one. What is this? Math question, that is problem. Next. An animal, a cowboy rides, it's a horse. Next, number three, parts of the house, it's a room. Next, number four, parrots and penguins are birds. Okay, next is, what number? What number we are now? Number five. Number five is study. Once more, it's re- it should be review. First one is I, W. Next, number six, finish, whole, complete. Next, number seven, restore or re repair. It's rebuild. Number eight, opposite of go away. It's return. And number nine is, can you blank the story? Retell. And the last one is number ten. It's, I have to rewrite. 
and think all is complete check and done okay so if you check our week 3 activity we're all done from 24 to 35 so that is our week number 3 week number 3 is letter R and a letter R E or RE okay meaning again so that is our id club spelling and vocabulary this vocabulary this day hope you learned something in our simple tutorial in our typing club dot com okay so if you like this video don't forget to click like and of course subscribe our channel this is david 101 till next time again have a nice day everyone